Hi guys, I am showing you how to add variations to a product in WooCommerce. The first step is to install Wustify Pro in your store. In your dashboard, go to Wustify Options. Find Variation Swatches add-on, click on Activate to enable it. Then head to the Settings button and do some settings on the Variation Swatches add-on. Here, you can set the style as square or circle. Enable or disable product variations on the shop page in Quick View. You can also edit the size of variation. Enable tooltips. And customize its background and text color as you desire. Then, you can change the number of variations you want to show on your product page. However, the default number should be 30 to make your product page look beautiful. Once finishing, you click here to save all. Go to Product, then click on Attribute to the Step 2. Here we are creating new attribute for the product. Fill in the name and slug. Also, don't forget to tick the box Enable Archives. For the type of attribute, here I select color. Next, about the sort order of the terms in the attribute, you can select custom ordering. Complete it by clicking on the add attribute button. Now, choose configure terms to create specific colors for your products. Here I will add blue color, for example. Cover the name and slug first. Then, move to the color section. Click on select color, you will see a table of color to display. Adjust to choose the color you want. Add new color and you have a blue term like that. You can repeat this process to create as many colors as you want in the color attribute. Okay, let's see. I have created four colors, red, white, black, and blue. The third step is to add these variation swatches to a specific product. I select this one, yoga cotton shirt. Scroll down. In the product data, select the variable product. Select attributes tab and add color. In the value box, you select any colors for the shirt just from the list you have created before that. Remember to tick used for variations to show them on the product page as other versions of the original item. Remember to save attribute. Move to the variations tab. From this drop down, select add variations and click on go. Repeat the action to add as many variations as you want. Now start to create variations with each color. Add images. SKU, regular price. Sale price, stock status, weight, length, width, and height to each variation. Continue manually adding the information to other variations. After adding variations is done, you save changes. Now update to save all the changes to product variations. Then, preview changes to see how variation swatches display on your store. Besides product pages, the variation swatches you have created also work on category pages, shop pages, and quick view as you set up as step 2. 
That's all about WooCommerce Variation Swatches. Thanks for watching our video.